Bereshit chapter 20. And Avraham set out from there to the land of the south, and dwelt between Kadesh and Shur, and stayed in Gerar. And Avraham said concerning Sarah his wife, She is my sister. And Avimelech, sovereign of Gerar, sent and took Sarah. But Elohim came to Avimelech in a dream by night, and said to him, See, you are a dead man because of the woman whom you have taken, for she is a man's wife. However, Avimelech had not come near her, and he said, Yahweh, would you kill a righteous nation also? Did he not say to me, She is my sister? And she, even she herself, said, He is my brother. In the integrity of my heart and in the innocence of my hands I have done this. And Elohim said to him in a dream, Yes, I know that you did this in the integrity of your heart, and so I kept you from sinning against me. For this reason I did not let you touch her. And now, return the man's wife, for he is a prophet, and let him pray for you and you live. But if you do not return her, know that you shall certainly die, you and all that are yours. So Avimelech rose early in the morning and called all his servants and spoke all these words in their hearing. And the men were greatly frightened. And Avimelech called Avraham and said to him, What have you done to us? In what have I sinned against you that you have brought on me and on my reign a great sin? You have done matters to me that should not be done. And Avimelech said to Avraham, What did you have in view that you have done this matter? And Avraham said, Only because I said to myself, The fear of Elohim is not in this place, and they shall kill me for the sake of my wife. And yet, she is truly my sister, she is the daughter of my father, but not the daughter of my mother, and she became my wife. And it came to be, when Elohim caused me to wander from my father's house, that I said to her, This is your loving commitment that you should do for me, in every place wherever we go, say of me, He is my brother. Then Avimelech took sheep and cattle and male and female servants, and gave them to Avraham. And he returned Sarah his wife to him. And Avimelech said, See, my land is before you. Dwell wherever it is good in your eyes. And to Sarah he said, See, I have given your brother a thousand pieces of silver. See, it is to you a covering of eyes before all who are with you and before all others. And you are cleared before everyone. And Avraham prayed to Elohim, and Elohim healed Avimelech, and his wife and his female servants, so they bore children. For Yahweh had closed up all the wombs of the house of Avimelech because of Sarah, Avraham's wife.